what is up my lovelies welcome back to another video if you're new to my channel my name is Keandra don't forget to like comment share and subscribe also if you're a regular viewer welcome back and don't forget to hit that post notification bell to be notified every time a video drops now let's just get into the video <laughs> guys so i'm back with another girls talk video if that's what i'm not sure what i'm going to title this video as but just know some other chat will leap yeah so in today's video i'm going to address a few things that i've been seeing circling around social media tiktok blah blah, blah and just put my little sense on them you know because my love chat and me no know me no know me no want to say them bother me but it's 2022 and honestly i don't even know like i don't even know what i'm trying to say right now i really even know what i'm trying to say but just know i'm gonna say something okay okay so we're gonna so the topics that i want to address or talk about mainly is like being a virgin in 2022 you know that's like one of the big things like it's a crime to be a virgin in 2022 like it's a really bad thing like kid you not it's like I don't even know how to even never speak on it and trust me. Trust me, make a chat only funny. But like that's one of the topics. Dating, relationships, sex. Also, another thing that I want to talk about um is like finding your purpose or like trying to accomplish goals at a certain age and like getting rid of that mindset or me don't know. Me don't know. But <laughs> sorry for yelling. But I am going to be talking about a few things and just like go into depth because I think I have mentioned these before multiple times. Um, but in this video, I feel like I want to go in details, like really in the like, like when I get to a scalp massage, go in there. Yeah, like, yeah. So if you're interested in hearing all of that, yabber, yabber, yabbering, keep watching. Okay, so first things first. The first topic that I want to talk about because I've seen TikToks like all over my FYP, like I've seen TikToks just pop up and I'm like, hmm, and I'm like, hmm, and the comments and what people say in the video, I'm like, are you for real? Like, are you serious? You know what I'm saying? So being a virgin in 2022. I mean, you either are one or you're not. I mean, it's not a crime. You know what I'm saying? I don't know why. I'm telling you, I don't know why the people them who loose and free feel like to them want to make people who are not loose and free feel bad about it. Like, you're not a virgin. I'm a virgin. Okay, and? You know what I'm saying? And I'm speaking from personal experience when friends or people who I know want me to tell them some you're a virgin. You're a virgin? really like being serious that's the response i got like the face the like the tone that's exactly what me get yeah virgin for real i'm sorry i didn't know i wasn't supposed to be one i'm confused you know what i'm saying and i kid you not i think i was i'm pretty sure i was 18 when 18 19 when that was brought up like the whole people looking at me like really i'm virgin i still virgin and i'm like saying i'm like i'm like i didn't know i was supposed to lose it at a, i didn't i didn't know there was a time on i had no clue you know what i'm saying and the way other people them look upon me you know people i actually can't people who i thought were friends you know are still are i'm not even sure like you no know, there's certain things that people do or say kind of just leave me appalled why may i use big words we don't even know what it mean <laughs> it just leave me stunned you know what i'm saying like i didn't know i was supposed to i did not know i was supposed to lose my virgin like okay let me explain come on bash the people them and then you know let me explain why people well mostly the males would assume that i am not one they thought i weren't a virgin because of how my move like i'll be dancing sometimes recording myself dancing twerking a little bit and mm, get it get it get it, whatever whatever and i post it you know and i'm saying based off of that i assume they think that oh i'm not one be serious no there are lots of virgins out there that can't work them can't go find them it's up and all kind of things yeah yeah so <laughs> i don't like that 
I don't like how that's one of the reasons why they thought that wasn't one because me know for shake my look a boom boom or whatever the case was. But be so serious though, it's 2022 and the way all people just behave, like when them ears say, oh, you're still a virgin, bro, it's 2022. Your fucking point? Yeah, it is 2022. I'm gonna keep this shit as long as I feel like keeping it. It's mine, it's not yours. Be serious though. And I'm saying, some girl too, you know, you have the girls then be like, I saw a TikTok, I, when I find it, I'm going to put the link in the description box so you guys can watch it for yourself and tell me if me overreact based on that. I don't know, maybe it's just me, but... In the TikTok, the man asked, what are your thoughts or opinions on virgins? They're lame, they suck. <laughs> What next girl say they're boring um another one say it's 2022 what are they afraid of da, 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 da. and then somebody else say i like to have fun they're lame da, 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 da. i don't and i kid you not there's only one person in the whole video will say it's like they're giving props to virgins but everybody else will be like they suck they're lame some other something and i'm like what did I do? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> like, virgins really got y'all triggered like that? Like, oh, damn. My bad. Whoopsie. Yes, I don't know. I just find it, I just find it a little weird that people be like, when I always claim for say, there are not enough pure women in the world. I don't want to consider that pure because, <laughs> but like, on a, on, on a say, when I can't find there little to no pure women in the world or everybody just have a and everybody have a sex and a da 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 and when I find them now the judgment on a on a on a, on a the, like I don't even know what I'm trying to say right now is just I don't know 2022 is a weird ass year bro and I thought the years before this was weird but the weirdness just stay up 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 like all the way up you know what i say and <clears throat> i'm not sure if i am the only virgin in my friend group i think i am i don't want to talk too much because i don't know i don't know anybody's life i don't know what's going on i don't care but i think i'm the only virgin left is someone feel good about that because even if i wasn't oh well but i am so big flex because what i want to say and i'm like sir, cause I'm not bones from this and I'm not bones from that and I lick this on I kiss that on L. Damn. Like unsanitary much? Like shit. You know what I'm saying? And that's another reason to why my soul my t my, my freedom man. God no <laughs> Bad. Because men say, oh you can look a woman. That is the next topic. Let me just shut up and hold on to it. But yeah, like being a virgin in 2022, if you still are a virgin in 2022 and you happen to spot this video, congratulations. Big up yourself, girl. Big up yourself, boy. Because I feel like there's, I don't know what boy in this world is a virgin. I'm, I'm not, I don't want to talk too much on that. I don't want to judge y'all, but I mean, I don't fucking know. <laughs> but if you are a virgin in 2022, and you're contemplating losing it this year, or you have, you just, you're all on party for as long as you're cool, that you just lose it. Kudos to you, you held on for as long as you could. You know, you have some, you have some 20 something year old virgin, 30, women well, don't want to talk too tough on them, them not, for them, you know what I'm saying? But the ones who are in their 20s and still holding on to it for their life, <laughs> go on, hold on. Go on, all on, because the men these days is like, I don't know. I don't want to talk too much. I don't want to bash the other species. I don't want to bash the other gender. But do better. Do better. Do fucking better. Okay? Okay. So we're going to move on to the next topic now that kind of relates to this one. They all relate to each other. But like, yeah. I'm not going to let me love chat. No, seven minutes for. Sure. Anyways, next topic is dating slash relationships. Which rich kind of entails with the whole virgin thing. Um, the way okay, so speaking for me on 
oh, speaking on me and my experience or whatever, me never did me never did with nobody. Never did with a soul. You get me I say? Um the way how I was raised, my mother was not in my life, you know. Woman did left me. I joke, I joke, I joke, mommy, I joke, mommy. I love the same way. But I was only around my dad. You know, I remember my father almost 14 years of my life. I was by my father's side. You know what I'm saying? And that man, the way I say, when I say overprotective, the man more protective than police. Kid you not. That man was way more protective than police. When I say the man there, everywhere. And if him not dead there, somebody dead there. And then I watch me. Like, be so serious. <laughs> Overprotective. But it was fine because I wasn't the people person anyways. Because when school, when I got school, I come home, I stay in my house, I play with daddy them, I watch TV. I don't be outside because, hmm, what's out there? You know what I'm saying? And I went to all girls' schools my whole life until I came here. So, um, I went to all girls' school. I went to a primary all girls' school when I was out there and I went to a primary Girl, what? I went to an all girls primary school when I was out there. And I went to an all girls high school for like two years. Yeah, so I never boy, I never see boy until weekend. <laughs> when I went to church, I didn't see boys until weekend. But when I went to high school, though, there was an all boys school like right around the corner from where my school was. So I see boy, but I'm not really too okay with the boy then. You know? Yeah, so I didn't really interact with males until the weekend when I got church on Saturday. no comment but um yeah so the whole male thing boys really was never my priority i wasn't interested in made it free but even if i did interested in that boys made it free of my father like post <laughs> like post afraid of the man me afraid of that man you know what i'm saying and i think other people felt the same way too like because i remember when i would be at church with my friend them and even if there was another girl amongst us and a more man than girl, if them ears are came to follow each on the compound, them scatter like roach. Be so serious though. Sometimes I feel like some of them did free for talk to me because my father did them about the place. Like, be serious. Be serious. The man not going on. Him do bites. Him do bites. <laughs> yeah, you know I'm saying? So dating and relationship was never really in my bubble. <laughs> it was never really a priority. It was never even when I come over here. I still didn't care for males. I didn't care for dating. People that think somebody gay. Why? People think somebody like, oh man, kid you not, but disgusted by them. <laughs> People think somebody like, oh man. Like, when me hear it, when I was. When me did go to school, when I came here, I went to school, I messed with the girl, I'm just like, first of all, when I was at Alpha in a Jamaica and Judges, the girl, I'm just like, the nasty that the girl, I'm over here, so best believe that. I'm not hide and talk. The girls in Jamaica, at school, the nasty that the girl, I'm over here, so very nasty super nasty i've seen things so i'm coming on my seat i'm like it's way more open over here than it expected over there because why pan this fire that burn this da, 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 da. i'm like okay you know what i'm saying so i'm gonna come over here now i'm gonna see the girl and i kiss up at the staircase and i'm gonna it's like watching <laughs> it's like up close and personal they don't even care that they're being watched like ew man <laughs> like i was so unfamiliar with the whole boy and boy and girl and girl and i'm like it's gonna take a while to get used to. <laughs> like it's gonna take a it's gonna take a while. It's gonna take a minute, a strong minute. Me and you said that shit until two years later. You know what I'm saying? Be so serious. You know what I'm saying? So I don't even know. 
I think I'm just rambling at this point. This may be unfiltered, not filtered. I'm not sure, but I think I'm like 12 minutes into this conversation. I'm not probably get tired already, but um, what else may I say? Yeah, the dating. Back to the whole dating thing. I was, if I wanted to date somebody, I was completely terrified of asking that anymore. Like I was struggling in school, so I'm gonna be approach boy. I approach my father, bona boy. We used to make up lie and some day with somebody. But watch this, you know? I used to tell people, people used to come to me with for them personal life. God, them trust me or something like, I'm not care what going on in life. Tell me, okay, cool. I'm going to react how a friend would react. But me, no, I'm not telling nobody, I'm going to trust you. And I was right to do so. I used to tell lie and tell, me, tell people, say, oh, I'm going to have man a meter half a tree. I say, when I hear my father come back to me, I'm like, I know who tell you. I know who tell you. I never tell if me for do it somebody, I'm not telling nobody a soul. That this all that 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 teach me a strong and valuable lesson. The girl tell my father send me there with man. I don't let me tell she never trust the girl was a set up team. I tell hey, more this time I test my friend and my number come once who I got open them mouths. Mo once who I got in farm. Mo I know. Yeah. Me I watch you know. Yeah, so the whole dating thing now, I'm probably trying to say, girl, your life's sad, sad, bad. Oh, well. Yeah, the whole dating thing was never really my forte. My might flirt with a few people here and there. I could care less if they're in a relationship or not. If you flirt with me, I'll flirt back with you. If anything happens, it happens. But it's not my fault. You know what I'm trying to say. I don't know what I'm trying to say. At this point, I'm just trying to. I'm mean, gonna know. I'm gonna try to say. I'm gonna try to say. I'm gonna try to say. I'm gonna try to I'm just trying to shed light on the fact that these are things that are still happening, like 2022. I'm gonna like all virgin things to attack me, you know. The people them say, virgin them lame and suck. <laughs> oh, damn. Is that how you really feel about me? Is that how you really feel about me? They suck. Anyways, um, next thing that I want to talk about is like, um, did I finish talking about the whole dating thing? I think I was. I think I was. Well, let's just get into the whole sex of it all, cause we don't know. Sex. One thing more to stop do is ask people them body count. We're not interested. <laughs> Me not interested. Because my dose away, why they come for past five? That's just my opinion. I'm sorry. I'm not try to judge, but I'm not say why your body come for past five. That's just crazy. And then if I pass, and like people who sleep with. Can you just shut the hell up? My name attack you. I'm not try to judge nobody, no, I'm just confused. I'm flabbergasted. I, I'm really confused, Josh. I'm confused. Why your body come past five? Why it past ten? Why is it 10? You hear me, I said? Yeah. I'm not trying to judge too much. You know what I said? I'm just curious. But the whole sex thing, though, on a nah, protect on yourself. Me thinks that 2020 and 2021 would have only for baby. A beer breeding is going on 2020. No shade to my partner in crime. Love you, honey bunch. But the rest are, oh no. Well, it's a few to girl. <laughs> like. Can you not have sex sex? I'm afraid of, I'm afraid of that. I'm afraid of you. Like, I'm afraid of everybody at this point. People in general. No specifics. Just people in me, female, male, she male, he male, we male. I am afraid of all of you genders. Honestly. Terrified. Because y'all be trifling. Super, super trifling. Like, I just saw something on Shade Room, or I'm not sure what it was, or Hollywood Unlocked. Where a man deliberately I give people HIV. <laughs> no, but be serious though. The man deliberately I give people the HIV. I guess I'm gonna judge people on myself, on myself, when the ears, oh, she's so judgmental. Blah, blah, blah. Me, own, me, own up to me judgmental, you know. Me not judging secret, me judge way out loud. Cause if you are do something, or you have on something, or you look a certain way, or you say something women are like, 
me gonna make it known. Me not like it. That not look good. Yeah. Oh my god. I am trying my best to not sit up here and call a female. I call them most of them name, but y'all be crazy. Y'all be trifling. The whole sex thing now. Me not know. Me not know. The whole virgin dating thing now. I don't even know what the point of this video is. I don't know what the point of this video is. But that's why I run off my mouth. This is a talk sesh. Feel free to comment down below your experience. If you are not a virgin or if you still are a virgin, way up. Like, talk to me. Feel free to comment below and talk to me. I am here. I am a listening ear. Me will fling some advice in a way from I've for fling. Some advice. Yeah, me fling a year away from I've for fling. And just let me know what's going through your head. Because I don't know I'm going to share my one. Because I'm completely stressed right now. Honestly, I think I did have this video locked down because what I really wanted to do was a paint and sip, but I can't bother paint nothing. Right about I'm just smiling and I'm going to like eat something. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I love chat, I say. Not to me, I try to say. Anyways, let's just finish the video before I get really bored. Okay, so next we're going to talk about trying to accomplish goals at a certain age or putting time on goals are like just trying to find your purpose in life before you know what I say what I say what I say so me at 21 so turn 22 <laughs> me I get oh anyways yeah I'm a soul turn 22 I'm 21 and I'm not in school anymore I think I mentioned this in most of my videos I'm not in school when I was going to school I was doing fashion mer fashion merchandising and retailing that was my major I am um, trying to figure out if that's what i want to go back to school and do or i want to do something else you know yeah because now i'm in the youtube world i'm thinking about graphics designing i don't know something with designing can we just get really excited interior designing graphic designing fashion i want to do i want to think or consider what i would go back to school for where i would go back to school and all that good stuff yeah, currently looking for a job and I don't talk more at work. Comment down below if you're in New York. Look it, hook me up a job. Yeah, more at work. I've made bills up here. And my lifestyle I'm pretty expensive. I'm a pretty expensive child. My parents know this and can't stand me. When me want something, then them them eat me because me expensive bad. Ah, when you not expensive enough, me just expensive. Yeah. But um I not have everything figured out because I kid you not, every man when I wake up, I literally sleep, I stay in that same spot and overthink and stress a good two hours. I don't have talk, I stress. I don't work. But I put in my son, I'm raising me there, I apply things. I sit in that spot, I lay in that spot and stress and overthink for a good two hours. This need to get done, this need to do, this need to fix, that need to buy. With what money? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And best, best believe it. When my father said over there, they like, going back to school, da, da, da. And that's the next thing too. Like, I always get these text messages asking me about school, when they're going back to school. And I don't want to disrespect nobody. I really don't. But every time when they ask me, when I ask for one bad word, I'm not like to. No. It's getting very annoying. Leave me alone. Nobody not rush you. Don't rush me. Me are a two different person. Don't rush me. I hate it. Stop questioning about school. I like it. I hate it. I don't make it known to. And I stop asking me for five minutes now. How was school? What's your plan for school? I look like I know. If I didn't know anything, I didn't figure it out already. Every minute they ask me, you know, about school. Why you stop school? They don't school. The people them kick me out of them school because my grades them did lock in. Shit, man. <clears throat> Every minute someone talk about school, school, school and go back to school and da 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 Nobody not think about school right now. People try to look money. Wanna work. Shit. <laughs> Whoever get that, get that to know, but I have no idea how long this video is and I have no idea what the hell I said. If I said anything that sparked some inspiration in you or motivation in you or if I said anything that really helped or benefited you, I'm I'm glad. Good luck. 
you know, go forth. Um, I'm a kid at heart. I am a six-year-old child in a 22-year-old body. So, <laughs> yeah. I am a six-year-old kid in a 21-year-old body. So, I don't know what I'm saying half the time. I don't know what I'm doing half the time. So, it is what it is. I have a lot of growing to do. I don't like what people say, yeah, big people, you know. I'm a big in a body, yes, but my mind is very little. <laughs> my mind is very little bit. Little bit bad. So, nobody I come, come rush me, come talk about, oh, you're grown or you're an adult now or no I'm not. No come put the A word upon me. Me I still want young me I still want young ins. Me adolescent adult adolescent. Yeah. Me not reach the adult part yet. Me not start pay bills, me not drive car, Freda would like put my afraid, afraid you know? Don't make this fool and I'm afraid bad. Afraid bad. Outside just scare me. Outside just my shit. Me nervous. But yeah, um, what else did I say? That video is long now, ass. Um, thank you. I'm trying to think. Think. I have nothing else to say. Nothing else is sparking to me. Nothing else now. Nah. up. Um, but. Do you guys like my hair? This is the first video I'm going to see before you said that I won. <laughs> Excuse me. Do you guys like my hair? I got it done last week, Friday. Friday gone? Yeah. Do you like it? Let me know if you love it. Anyways. Okay, guys. So, that is the end of the video. I have no idea what this, this video even is. Um, I guess I can call it a talk session with Key. Talking with Key. Talk session with Key. I don't know. I'm trying to find a cute name for it. But, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Got something from it. If you did, I'm glad. Feel free to leave some... Feel free to leave a heart in the comments. Anything in the comments, really. Um, you want to keep this conversation going, feel free. I'm here. Um, and yeah. That's pretty much it. Don't forget to check the links in the description box. I might drop the videos in there that I want you guys to see if we find them. Um, but yeah, that's all. That's, that's all. That's it and that's all from me. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Love you. I get to you, girl, like what it do, girl You lookin' cool, girl, come and be my new girl